Alright guys, I'm going to be giving you my final updated look of CyanogenMod 10.1 nightly builds for the GSM Galaxy Nexus. So let's jump right into settings. Go down to About Phone. And I am running the latest nightly version, which is January 12th. I know it is the 13th, but the 13th build isn't out as of yet. So let's go back. And I know a lot of you have been asking for this, so now if we go into System, we can finally customize the navigation bar. So you just gotta un unlock it. And you see the little plus arrow over there and also over here. So you can just hit plus and you can add a menu button. But since you don't want too many buttons, you can just change that to an empty button. And then if you lock it, and now you, you have your own menu button, which is a pretty neat feature. It's not like AOKP where you can have, I think, seven. I'm not sure how many you can have in AOKP, but you can have more. So let's go home. Now, when you add like another button, I notice that the other buttons don't aren't as responsive. So that's just a little heads up. And if we go back into settings, there's not really much else changed. I mean, you still have all the features that that you've had before. So there's not really much. I mean, they have improved the fluidity, so that has improved, and it's a little bit faster. You, you now have this Cronus clock, I think they call it. I'm not sure what they call it. Which is pretty neat. It's also on the lock screen. So if I unlock it, here is that Cronus clock. So if you swipe down, you still have the weather and stuff. So it's kind of like the CM weather off of uh, CM10. I don't know if you guys remember that. So long ago that we were on CM10. I'm jump joking. Um... But that's pretty much it. If you guys want me to cover anything else about this ROM, just let me know in the comments below. But I thought that was the only feature that was noticeably different. Everything else is pretty much the same as in the previous nightly builds. And they are implementing a lot of new features, so be on the lookout for those. Follow me on Twitter for the latest updates because I normally post a lot about the uh, latest updates for this ROM. And also of what ROMs I'm flashing and other stuff like that. But I'm going to be flashing another ROM just to test it out. So if you guys want to know anything else about CM10.1, just let me know in the comments or on Twitter, whichever. And I'll try to get to it. And if you guys like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see any more videos like this, be sure to subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video.